Hello everybody, it's Gomato Cinnamon here again, and today I'm going to be teaching you all how to chirp, and without a squeaker. This reduces the hassle of, you know, risking you're going to choke or something like that, because the squeakers that you find in pet stores, what if you breathe wrong and it goes like, and you die or something? <laughs> I don't know, but I just didn't prefer the pet squeaker, because one, it has the same pitch over and over again. It depends on how you use it. I mean, I don't know every single tip and trick. One thing you need to have is a high vocal range. I mean, being able to get your voice up very high for the chirp. It's And the ability to, um like, roll your tongue like, Harrr, something like that, you know. First thing you gotta do when you chirp is get your voice way up high. And say the word, ew, like you're saying something gross. But, more like a short, like, Ew, something like that. That is the basic chirp. And you just go like, ew, 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 ew. and it sounds like a chirp. I mean, it doesn't sound like you're really like straining anything, and you don't want to strain anything, because if you strain something, um, <laughs> sorry about that. Um, that's not really how you do the chirp. Now, if you want to add more of a purr, you'd have to know how to roll your tongue. So, Basically, roll your R's in a really high-pitched voice, like something like that, like something like that. It's, I mean, it's difficult. I'm taking Spanish classes. I'm kind of learning how to roll my tongue, and I knew how to roll my tongue in the past, and oh my goodness, it's exhausting. Now I know about like a hundred percent, like telephone squeak, but it's it's okay. I mean, I'm kind of a new to the squeaking thing, but I kind of want to teach everyone else to know how to squeak because they may just want to squeak and they don't want to use a squeaker because they either don't want to choke on it, they can't, you know, put it into their paw pad or anything. So this little tutorial I hope helped people and, you know, good luck. And comment something below if you want, you know, videos on other things, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.